Are you guys ready for this? Every every 616 game, you know it's coming. I don't know how loud it's going to be. Shit, now I'm sweating. Dude, that, that was my cardio for the day, by the way. All right, so this is Deer, the latest game by 616 Games. Let's go. Deer. Dear God. Dude, you know it's going to be good when there's actually credits in the beginning. I don't think there's a sensitivity button, is there? Yes. I guess I'll turn it down to one. Okay, that's a little bit better. I hate whenever the games are like super fast. It's uh, it's scarier if you don't move as fast. We're not trying to crank 90s in Fortnite, okay? We're just trying to get scared. Ooh, what's this? What is that? I have no idea. I thought it was like a camcorder or something. Can we take the gun? Cannot take the gun. Oh, dude, what if the game is about a deer seeking revenge? Because the tagline in the beginning said, you reap what you sow. So like, what if, uh, oh my God, I remember these. I think my mom had some of these paintings around the house back in the... Uh, the 80s and 90s uh like what if you killed this deer's friends and or family and now the deer is coming to get you and in that case who's the real monster is it the deer who's seeking revenge or is it you who started this shit i'm just looking to see here we got we got a set of keys that we cannot pick up i thought this was a horror game you mean there's a set of keys we can't pick up we can't grab anything okay maybe that comes later i'm afraid to get charged by a deer here we go. Okay, no no deer meat, no deer bologna, no deer steaks in the fridge. Can't use the frying pan as a weapon. No deer outside looking through the window. What if I'm the deer? I don't I don't know. I can't see my legs, so um I'm not sure. We could be a deer. We're going outside. No gun, no protection. It's dark as shit. Dude, we're already going outside. Why, why are we even out here? No flashlight. Okay, a deer by the lake. My chance of getting meat. Do I go back in and grab my gun? I don't think I've ever played a horror game where you're you're a hunter. Like a hunting simulator horror game. Yes. All right. What is this? World at War? We can't leave. All right. Is that a flashlight down there? Ooh. No, it's our, it's our sight. Okay. Can we take the candle for light? I'm going to need something out there. It is like pitch black, man. You expect me to hunt a deer in this? Oh, yeah, yeah, right there. Do you think there's any bullet drop? Do you think I could shoot it from here? All right, I'm going to shoot it right there. Nice shot, but I don't think I killed him. I may have. It's making noises. It sounds like it's hurt. Oh, okay, now we have a flashlight. We automatically pulled it out. All right, we have a blood trail. Oh, my God. I never thought they could make a deer hunting game scary we went hunting all the time in red dead i was i was never scared there but this this is definitely a little different i think i'm just waiting for like a massive buck with like glowing red eyes oh my god dude oh no mm. hey kids sorry about your mom she was taking care of her children did we lose is that, is that game over? Oh no! Ugh. So he killed the he killed the babies. At least he didn't show it, you know. I'm sorry, kids. Where's the dad though? That's the that's the real issue here. I'm sorry, Bambi. Okay. They they did set it up. Like that's a pretty sad moment. So it's really going to justify the revenge of the father. Again, I'm just I'm just spitballing here. I don't know. I'm basing all of these predictions off the the intro screen. It's the Punisher in deer form. Yeah, it's the plot of the Punisher. Except it's a deer. Okay, I'm very hungry. I'm going to prepare something for lunch. Okay, now there's deer meat. Lots of deer meat. Oh, we're going to be eating good for days. Okay, I guess I'll prepare some lunch. Oh, that's a good looking steak. Dude, I'm waiting. Do you think we're going to see a scene where like the buck is peeking through the window? All right, we'll throw this in the pan. I'm like the paranoid hunter. Did I fuck up? Is this deer out for revenge? <laughs> I can't stop looking out the window, man. Steak looks scary? What? Eats it right out of the pan. 
Shit, I think I'm going crazy. It's in the house, or at least it... All I saw was its arm sticking out. Did you guys see that? I guess I'll have some more steak. Shit, I'm, I'm going crazy. Build a fire, watch some TV. Wait, you don't think it's in the closet, do you? Okay. All right, good. The deer wants his family back. I just give him like a bag of meat. Here you go. Sorry, dear God. Where's that coming from? I don't know where it sounded like it was coming from inside the house. Hello? We can't jump. We can't, I can't even go down there. That's as far as we can go. Guys, uh, false alarm. I know you guys got your hopes up. Uh, it's not an open world game. All right, I'm sorry. It's it's not the open world game that we thought it was. We thought that Deer by 616 Games was gonna be the next Skyrim and uh, apparently not. Oh man, look at the detail on that water. Man, Rockstar Games has been real quiet ever since this game dropped. I love how the, like, the plants grow right out of the lake. It's a real nice touch. All right, I'm gonna go back to the crime scene. Where was it? It was over here, wasn't it? It was somewhere in this thicket. No, I think it was right here. Yeah, it was like in this area. All right, no sign of the dad. All right, I'm gonna go back inside. Maybe the deer's in the bathroom. It, when I heard the noise, it definitely sounded like it was coming from inside the house. Oh! Oh! It was all a dream. It was all a dream. Oh, man. Was he there the whole time? When I left the house, I never checked back here. I think I just went outside. Wow, okay. All right. All right, dear. I see you. Let me shut that. Oh, so how's everybody doing? Wow, dude. I didn't expect him to be inside the house. So now what? Do we eat again? I'm playing it like I would in real life. I just woke up, so I would assume some time went by since the last time we ate. And now it's time to eat again. All right, now I'm nervous to walk in the bathroom. I just wanna make sure I'm not missing anything. Nothing under the bed. I know you guys said about the bed. Can't kick back and watch TV. I feel like I should definitely stay armed, but it won't let me take the gun unless we're going hunting. All right, and nothing. I'm gonna leave those open. That way, if we ever come in here and those are closed, then we know something's up. So I'm just gonna walk down towards the car, maybe sit down on a bench, relax a little bit, enjoy the weather. It is a nice day outside. Nothing here. That, my car is here. That didn't sound like my car. Cause it, it sounded like it was coming from uh, like off to the left. Is there a car up here? Is, wait, is there a deer in my car? Let's rule that out first. Okay, no, there's no deer in the car, but it didn't sound like it was this car. It sounded like it was coming from over here. Oh shit. Is that, is that the game commission? Ah, hello officer. What can I do for you? Good morning, Sam. Unfortunately, I bring bad news, friend. What if the deer killed our family? Yeah, uh, we got word that your family was murdered. Yeah, your wife and two kids. Yeah, they're gone. They found they found deer hoof prints everywhere. Uh, case is still unsolved. Killers at large. Good morning, Steve. What's the matter? We received some reports of gunshots. Uh, you know you can't hunt animals this time of year. Okay, so so we're the we're the problem. <laughs> All right, family's safe. Family's safe. Family has not been murdered yet. This again? I was just shooting bottles. You know, practicing a little. I'm sorry, friend. I need to take you to prison. These are the sheriff's orders. Okay, I'm gonna have to kill this guy. Shit, is this really serious? Are you going to arrest me, man? I just follow orders, Sam. Grab some clothes and let's go. I'll wait here. Am I naked? <gasps> Hold on a second. Hey, man, I'm gonna go grab some clothes, but this is probably gonna be the last time that we're gonna see each other. So um, it was it was nice knowing you, dude. I'm guessing that the deer's gonna kill him. We're gonna go get clothes. We're gonna come back and uh, and he's gonna be dead. There, there's no way this game is taking us to prison. I'm sorry, Steve, I can't get arrested. <gasps> we, we have to, we have to kill him. Oh no. I keep thinking that the deer is gonna get involved. 
I'm sorry, Steve. There's no other way. I can't go to jail. It's the first day of deer season. If you arrest me now, I'm going to miss the whole thing. He's pushing the car into the lake. All right, I guess we have to make some more room in the fridge. What if this game isn't even about a deer? What if everything's in my head? I'm I'm the killer. Now I need to go bury the body. I'm sorry, my friend. Are we carrying the body? It's just, it says we need to bury the body, but it doesn't say where. Maybe back where we saw the, the deer originally? And I, I got no flashlight. This doesn't feel right. Like usually there's some sort of an indicator of like which direction to go. I'm going around back. Oh, here we go, here we go. Shovel. There we go. See? Like they're not gonna let us just roam around forever trying to find a spot. They gotta tell us. All right, so we're burying the body in the backyard. The deer's watching this whole thing. I know your secrets, human. I know what you've done. But well, where's the body though? Oh, oh my God, here he is. Okay, now we got him. All right, and you go right here. And then I guess we fill it back in with another amazing, highly detailed cutscene. Okay, and we're done. Just leave the shovel there. It's almost like they want us to side with the deer. Like they're really painting us out to be a really bad person. So like when the deer gets revenge, we're gonna go, oh, well that makes sense, we deserved it. We're playing through the eyes of the villain in this game. Okay, no deer in the bathroom. No deer in the bathroom. Closet doors are still open. Character said he's tired. Sam is his name. Sam said he's tired. So let's go to bed. Probably another nightmare, right? That's the that's a deer right there. Is that the cop? What's on the wall? <gasps> okay, so the dream was about the dead cop and the family of deer. And what was up with this? There was something on the wall here. Did you guys see it? It was like a red something that was forming on the wall. I need to go into town to buy some drinks. The days have been difficult. All right, let's go get some drinks. I'm gonna go check on that cop and make sure he's still buried. As long as his hand doesn't reach up and grab my leg. I love how we left the shovel. Like we did nothing to disguise this. Like in Breaking Bad, when Walter buries those barrels, he still like, you know, he tries to like smooth out the desert. He puts a bush there and some other stuff like to make sure it looks undisturbed. No, not only do we have it completely exposed, but we have a shovel as a tombstone. Car looks good. Examining the car, I'm doing a uh, 100 point inspection to make sure that the, our car has not been messed with by a family of zombie deer. Oh, you know what? Car keys. I gotta get the keys off the table. Okay, we got the car keys. It won't. Oh, there we go. All right. I guess we get in the passenger side. Seven hours later. Oh, dude, we're gonna be drunk as fuck. Damn old car. Good thing I'm close to home. Wait, what are we holding? It's a bag. Dude, why do we only have our flashlight in that one part of the game? All right, so we have our doggy bag. Oh, thank God. Okay. All right, so the car broke down. We have our doggy bag of drinks. Oh! What the fuck, dude? Okay, <laughs> I wanted to get a good look at it. Let's not mess around. Which way are we? I think we're heading this way. Dude, I gotta, I gotta get a good look at this thing. <laughs> Dude, oh my God, man. I love how it doesn't move. It just floats towards you. I'm not even looking back. I'm fucked, I'm fucked. I don't know where home is. Like where we first shot the mom. 
I thought that's where we were, and we had to just loop around to the house. That's not where we're at. I have no idea where we're at. Ah, now I'm deer meat. Yep. Maybe the house is on that side. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, we made it home. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh. I feel like we just barely made it. <laughs> We're hiding under the bed. I can't tell if the shower's running or if it's raining outside. Oh, it's, okay. It's definitely storming outside. Oh, he's in the house. All right. He's not just floating. He's actually moving around. I love how it's standing on two legs. Whatever you do, don't check under the bed. What's it? Is it going to leave? I, I guess we went back to sleep. We just passed out. All right, well, we made it to bed. Was that a dream? I don't think that was a dream. Cause like, okay, I don't know. If it wasn't a dream, at what point did he decide it was safe to stand up? Like crawl out from under the bed. All right, all the lights are off. It's raining outside. What the fuck is happening to me? Rifle's gone. Oh, oh no. I didn't even notice. Yeah, the rifle's gone. So not only do we have a zombie deer on the loose, it has a gun. What's happening to me? What? This must be a nightmare. Dude, someone dug a Spartan hole in my backyard. Did the deer do that? Oh, I can actually see the bottom. Dude, it definitely looks like some kind of twisted weird dream. Yeah, some kind of weird reality. Jump, I, yeah, I can't jump down there. I would if I could though, cause I'm curious. Dude, there's a deer in the front yard. It's not moving. I don't know, it could be a decoy. I think it's a decoy. Yeah, it, it's a wooden deer. Amazing craftsmanship. I could really use a flashlight right now. Dude, we're surrounded by wooden deer. So now what? Maybe I have to click on one of them. God, it's so dark. Oh my God, dude. This is like some kind of... What, what if the guy's not even on a, 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 a hunting trip? What if he's like just in a city somewhere, like in an alleyway, just drugged out of his mind? It's like, Sam, you've never gone hunting. This is... Okay, these are all nightmares for sure. Sam, you don't even... Uh oh! That was the cop! Sam, you don't even own a gun. <laughs> all right, so now we can grab the hatchet. <gasps> Maybe he, maybe Sam got rid of the gun as evidence. Why do I keep hearing screaming? You guys hear that? All right, I'm checking the closet. Okay, still nothing in the closet. Now I gotta go out back and see what the hell all that screaming is for. Is there a party in my hole? Okay, the hole's still here. Oh, I fell down the hole. Is that game over? No. Is that it? We fell down the hole and then we got shot in the hole? 
What? I don't know what happened. No, it's not just the demo. Is there more to it? I mean, I appreciate the effort. I like the concept. There could have been so much more they could have done with this. Do we think there's another ending? I'm going to continue. All right, guys. I guess that's it. No, no alternate ending. I bet the deer and kids are supposed to be the wife and kids. Could be a metaphor for depression. Yeah, the screams are in his head. That's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking it's like everything's just imagery. Like it's not supposed to be taken literally. All right, I'm going in. Yeah, like I, there's, you can't even see anything. Like there's, it's not like there's a deer or something standing there. Yeah, I'm wondering if that was all in his head. So maybe the gunshot came from inside the house, not in the hole. That's my theory. My theory is that, that the whole game represents some sort of depression. Yeah, he shot himself. That's the theory I'm going with. Let me know what you guys think.